Welcome to the Energy Lab at the University of Toronto, a teaching lab for thermodynamics and energy conversion technology. I'm Professor Jim Wallace, and I'll be your instructor for wind, waves, and tides. Our civilization has been spoiled by the ready availability and low price of fossil fuels. The ability to access unlimited power whenever we want it has dramatically increased our productivity, our standard of living, and opened up the world to travel on a large scale. Yet fossil fuels are a finite source of energy originating from plant mass that decayed over millennia by biological processes. There is growing recognition that ever increasing use of this resource of stored energy is not sustainable. It is a bit ironic that as we look to more sustainable energy sources for the future, we return to energy sources that were in widespread use prior to the Industrial Revolution when fossil fuels became readily available. Wind power has been used to power ships for millennia. The ancient Egyptians may have been the first to build seagoing ships. The tomb of Queen Hatshepsut, who ruled about 1500 BC, has illustrations of a sailing vessel. Windmills were used to mill grain and later to pump water and power other devices. The earliest historical references to windmills were in Persia in the 9th century and in Europe from 1185 onward. The power of tides was also recognized long ago. Tidal mills at the mouths of rivers in Britain and France were used to grind corn in the Middle Ages. As we focus once again on these renewable energy sources familiar from the past, a key question to ask is how can our current knowledge of science and engineering, our vastly superior range of materials, and our impressive control technology be applied to more effectively capture energy? My perspective in teaching this course is that of a mechanical engineer. I've spent my career researching internal combustion engines, alternative fuels, and emissions. Yet one always needs to check out the competition. Checking out the competition was what motivated my interest in sustainable energy. This Coursera course is a subset of alternative energy systems, a course I've taught for about 10 years. The Coursera course focuses specifically on producing power from motions that occur in nature, wind, waves, and tides. I hope you will join me as we explore and evaluate the technologies that generate power from these energy sources.